welcome back to Tall Rose Gaming Central, Hogwarts Legacy. We've been playing this for quite a while now. Um, we're on level 12. On the other game, I'm on level 27, 28, so uh, I'm a little bit ahead. But this is actually for a uh, YouTube edition. Okay, we're now going to attend flying class for the first time. You definitely need to fly around this map. Right, so let's see. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Yes, I will. Mr. Clothen, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or, in fact, tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Hey. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up, firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Begin. Up. Thank you. Now, your turn. Up. Up. Up, up you stupid ratty school broom. There you go. Come on. Up. Take your time. There you go. Up, up. you go. First time. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Good. Now. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do uh, take care. Uh, I the think I'm getting the hang of this. Property. I want them returned in one piece. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. Here we go. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! Ha! Good. I've got this. Ah, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Whoa! Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. <laughs> I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't probably met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Gryffindor like you might be interested? <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have? A, a bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. All right, come on in. Let's get up to mischief. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. 
Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is everyone flying so quickly? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part Hippogriff? There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And Meowlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself or frankly your broom the proper respect. But professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. And as for you? As for you. <laughs> you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good fly. But favoritism. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. Are you? It was worth losing a few house points. If you can, you should. Wish I could. There we go, we've reached level 13. Let's just have a quick look at the quests. At some stage, we have to go to Hogmeade's. We've, in fact, we've got to go there now, so we'll do that in the next instalment. Right, for those of you at home, that's how you uh, learn to fly a broomstick, which you're definitely going to need in this game. Broomstick, hippogriff, whatever, we'll need it all, even the grab horn. Okay, so uh, tune in next time, like and shine.